सो वेलकम बैक टू रियल टाइम चैट सीरीज एंड इफ यू वॉन्ट अ ग्रेट प्रोजेक्ट टू बी लिस्टेड इन योर रिज्यूम में दिस इज द ग्रेट प्रोजेक्ट अ रियल टाइम चैट सिस्टम सो इन दिस एपिसोड वी आर गोइंग टू यूज द व्यू फॉर आर सिस्टम एंड विद दैट I am your host Sarthak, and this is a channel where I talk about Laravel and the cool thing about Laravel. So, if you are new, don't forget to subscribe and like Bitfumes on Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. So, let's start and let's open PHP Artisan Serve and server is started. So, let's go to localhost and in the last episode we have created this route and all these things. Let's open console. Everything is good. what i want next i want to type something here and when i hit enter the word i have written here exactly i want to console log in this console so let's see how we can do that so i will go here and firstly i will what i will do i will open this asset js file inside resources folder go to app.js and here let's delete this comment i don't want this one also okay so now here we have to create a data okay and that data will be like will be like message and initialize with empty string okay so next is i want to create a methods so methods will be uh, let's say send simple okay and whatever i give i want to console log here so simply console log this dot message okay so it's very simple and now let's bind this message data to our input system so i will say v model is message okay so let's go and it says message is not defined in the instance because we have to compile our app.js so i will go here and i will say npm run watch so it will watch for every changes in this file so we have created this and it's compiling taking some time it's done so reload here okay so no error that means everything is fine open view tab root you can see message is empty but if i type hey you can see hey is written in the message as here but i want to hit enter and that hey has to be in the console so firstly what i will do on this key up so i have to say at or firstly you can say v on colon key up we will call the send method so let's refresh and if i say hey and you can see it's now having everything whatever i type in the console but what i want i want the specific key so you can obviously firstly change this to at that this is the shorthand for exactly the v on okay and now what i want view provide you very simple system so you will say dot enter so key up of enter you will bind the send method so send i have typed send here and now if i hit enter you can see the console has also the send here so that's very nice and if i now hit because we have not typed anything now if i hit enter it will exactly do the same thing it has to do it just consoling the empty string we have to prevent this so firstly prevent this so i have to say firstly that means if this dot message dot length is not equal to 0 okay so reload one more time hit and you can see i'm hitting you will hear the sound but it's not giving anything in the console that's very nice next thing we have to include these things in a component so let's do that so we have 
a example component given by the level but I want this to be a message component simply so that should be again message dot view so I have to rename this file so message obviously you can create a new file I want to just rename it so what I need I don't want this thing I want this one okay only one is good but not this one <laughs> active one this one and in here paste it okay and next we have to import this view component in our view so I will say here view dot component message which is like here so instead of all these things these three one what I can say I can say message simply okay very simple let's go reload and you can see one is there okay next what the next part next we need some kind of old messages that means the messages which are already there so we need many uh, list items here okay so obviously that means we need one data which accepts some array type or the object type things so now what I do I will initialize here chat which will have the object of message and that message is a array okay so now what I need I need some kind of system to have everything in the message so whenever I hit enter on this text box I want that message to be go on this chat message okay so like every time we do I have to say here this dot message and that should be this dot chat dot message dot push so we are pushing this message whatever I type on the text box so let's go here reload open this view tab this root and you can see the message array of the chat object is empty so let's type hey and now hit enter and click here and you will see now one message is arrived and it says zero and hey so let's give another hey how are you hit one more enter and click here yeah second message is also here so what I want I want to loop through these messages and display these message here in the list item so let's go back to sublime and here what I need uh, firstly I need to loop through that uh, messages so I will say here v for and is just like for each loop in the PHP so here I will say value in chat dot message so chat dot message is here okay and I'm looping through these values of the chat dot message so let's see what happened so let's go back yeah we don't have any messages here that's why we don't have any list item here so let's give that hey here and it says one here and then if I say how are you it's arrived one more but I want this text to be here okay and also this is going to be empty just after finishing this push part okay so firstly let's finish this so I will say this dot message is equal to empty so after pushing I have to empty out this message and now what I have to do if I open message dot view you can see we are hard coding the value instead we can create a slot so I will say slot and it is here and what this slot will do slot actually provide you to push any data on that part so where we have defined the slot we can actually push that slot data here 
So here I will say at value. Let's see what happened if I give this refresh and I will say hey and firstly it's not going to empty because I have to run npm run watch here npm run watch okay so it's here okay so now reload and it's good so hey and it's gone and you can see that hey is here and if I say how are you that is also here okay so this is a very cool part so you can see we are getting the data and two messages are here so that's very nice and hey how are you what are you doing and where are you going lots of questions I have asked <laughs> and if I do this you can see it's going long and long and long but I want to prevent this I want to have a specific height of this chat system chat window and that will scroll up so I will refresh it so there's nothing here so here I will do one thing I will just move this offset and call thing in a new div so that I can play with ULs okay so move this UL inside here and now I want to move this ally out from here and above this what this will do this will just move this out from here and now we can do something with this list group so we have this list group class so I will use a style and a style will give for list group and here firstly I will say overflow y scroll second part I will say height of let's say 200 pixel okay so this is good let's go reload and give various things and you can see now it's scrolling okay so this is very cool part it's scrolling now but there is some problem if you clearly see our input box is gone so I have to scroll down to get the input box back so I want to move this input box outside of the UL so that's good reload and now it's cool okay but here is another problem we have system for scroll but if I create new message it's not scrolling automatically so in the next episode we are going to see how we can create this actual scrolling automatic scroll system in our real-time chat system so be with me and we will cover great things and you will going to learn great thing so please share these video with your developer friend and if you have learned something from bitfumes and you want to support bitfumes please become the patreon and you can donate one dollar or above each month so that i can create good quality content for you so that you will grow easily and we will meet in the next episode till then goodbye